Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to the Arches National Park. And today we are going to do the Devil's Garden Trailhead uh, Arches. And there are quite a few arches on this trail. And we ended up breaking up some of these arches over several days. Because to do all the arches, it's just roughly uh, under 8 miles. 7.9 miles in and out to do all the arches. Uh, but if you have kids, uh, you, there are some few trails that uh, you just probably can't or may not want to go to so that's why I am back today on my own early in the morning to hit up the double O arch because uh, we were trying to do that yesterday and there's some pretty sketchy rocky areas so I came back today to do the double O to show you guys that trail and to see what it's all about so you guys have a good idea whether or not uh, you want to bring your kids up here and to give you guys some good idea of what to expect if you're coming up here as well. So yesterday we came up here and we hit these two arches and today we're going to we'll go about the same distance plus additional quarter mile to hit the landscape and partition in a Navajo. And then if we feel ambitious, we'll go all the way up here. Uh, but that's about it. All right, so here we go. So I'm not going to show you guys this particular trail again from here to the Pine Tree Arch, which we did yesterday. I'll leave a card right up here for you guys if you want to check that out. Uh, because we got to pass the Pine Tree Arch to get to the other arches that we're going on today. So I don't want to waste your time on this. Uh, so I'm going to start the video once we get to the Pine Tree Arch. So this is where the tunnels arch is, which is actually just right there. And then the pine tree is just down that way, about one tenth of a mile, where, where we made the snowman. So this is the fork, and this is the way you get to the landscape arch and the, doubles, the double O arch. I just want to show you guys what the trail looks like. Uh, getting there so you guys can make an informed decision and plan accordingly um, Yeah, so with that being said, I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys the trail Okay, and then I will stop and talk about the trail if we come across some obstacles and whatnot so we've gone about a good quarter of a mile from the parking lot on the way to the landscape arch and it's pretty flat uh, well, not flat, but it's smooth. The trail is very smooth. You guys can see behind me. It's just packed down gravel and dirt. Actually, it's it might be native, but they may have also they may have also brought in some artificial rocks and blended it and packed it. So if you have, let's say, like a mobility scooter um, or some type of a device to help you walk around. This part right here should not be an issue whatsoever, as um, long as there's no snow on, on the trail. Right now you got some snow in, and parts that are not, or parts that are dry. Okay, so let me turn the camera around and start walking. Look that fence, but another, uh, 100 feet up. So I'm not gonna go, up, go down there right now, but from here, you can really make out the landscape arch and it's just freaking beautiful. I think that uh, this is either the largest or the second largest arch uh, here in the park. But yeah, spectacular. Okay. So, all right, so now we are gonna be headed up to the double O. And this is the trail to get to the double O. And then at this point, you're on a primitive trail. So it's not the best marking. So you'll need to look out for signs like a metal post on the rocks uh, indicating which way to go. A little bit of rock climbing is involved through here, but I think you'll really enjoy the hike if you like rock climbing.
This is as far as mom and Isabella made it yesterday. We were trying to go up, but the rock was just too slippery because there's all these sand spots all over up here. It might be hard to tell, but it's a very slippery surface. Beautiful juniper tree. Okay, that's what it looks like behind us. And again, this is Okay, so while we're here, let's go to uh, the Partition Arch and the Navajo Arch. Uh, just, just about a quarter mile for both. All right, so let's do it. Okay. I think this is it. Wow. Okay, I think I kind of get it. Navajo Arch. Looks like a shelter. Oh, dude, I'm gonna. <laughs> back up here and show you guys. Wow, look at that big juniper. Okay, so ready? Three, two, one. I mean, let me do that again here. I'm gonna bump up my eyes so you guys, so you guys can really see. Okay, three, two, one. Hmm. Let's walk through it. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh, heck yeah. Well, what do you all think so far? If you guys liking this video, I would love it if you guys go down and smash that thumbs up and I would really support our channel. This is truly amazing. We are at the Navajo Arch. All right, let's go to the next one. All right, so we are back here at the junction where Navajo is straight ahead. And now we're gonna go to the partition arch which is that way. So let's go.
shot is breathtaking. Just amazing. Well, so what do you guys think? So why do you guys suppose they call this a partition arch? But I think because there's a wall that we've been hiking up against, then there's this opening right here. And there's another wall that goes this way. I think that's why they call it a partition arch. What do you guys think? I don't know. Leave me your thoughts and comments down below. <laughs> ah, it's breathtaking. So we're gonna do a whole separate video on the big old arch. Uh, it's about almost a mile up from that junction. And uh, otherwise this video is gonna be just way too big and no one's gonna watch it. I'm not sure if anyone's gonna watch this video. So hope you guys enjoyed the journey today. Uh, it's, it was actually a lot better than I expected. And you know, these arches are fantastic, but honestly, this particular trail um, was more about the journey than the actual arch. Arch is kind of the, you know, the, uh, the end result, but the journey is re really what makes these hikes around the Arches National Park really special. So God bless, love you guys. We'll see you guys uh, at the Big O Arch video.